So we're on our way up to Larford Lakes in Stourport, um, fishing a qualifier today for the On The Flyer TV Silverfish Final. It's a lovely final, uh, 10 grand for the winner. So hopefully we'll try and qualify today. It's gonna be mainly skimmers. I think you need to, need to win. Um, probably a weight of about 80, 80 to 100 pounds. This laugh at his ram pack with skimmers, and I'm pretty sure it's going to be a really, really good day. I know, I know last year they caught on meat. Um, I'm not going to go down that route, I don't think. It's a bit of wind about, it's a bit of rain, it's, it's, it's not very nice the weather. So I think I'm going to go down the route of putting a bit, bit of ground meat in, some dead red maggots, and some worms, maybe a bit of corn and try and catch everything that swims and hopefully it's enough but um, I have got some meat with me as well just in case I need a switch but depending on what peg I draw I think that's what I'm going to do, do today um, it's a, there's a star studded field of anglers up here today you know you've got all the J Muses, Andy Bennett's I mean there's a lot a lot of good anglers up here today so hopefully we'll draw a good area and catch a pile of fish and hopefully doesn't rain that much because I don't, I don't really want to get wet today but I think there's a good chance that I will be. It's going to be a very damp day but hopefully my spirits won't be damp at the end but we'll uh, we'll see now, we'll catch up when I draw my peg and hopefully we can film a lot depending on the rain but if I can, uh, if I can get the cameras out of the rain I'll try and film the whole match. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Fucking has a big gun as well. Don't want one of them first, fucking Chuck, you. Sorry? Don't want one of them first, Chuck. The size of cunt. It doesn't matter we can bully him on fucking lake here. Can I make her look like a skimmer?
So there we are, we've just finished the match, we're on our way home. Um, it's not gone my way to be honest. I decided to bowl along the whole line. I've caught a few fish on it early doors. I fed my short line quite heavy with ground bait, micros and sweet corn. And I caught most of my fish there to be honest. But the last hour, hour and 10 minutes have been a real nightmare. Um, I've got 16 carp. Just, just really ruined my swim to be honest. I've, I've hardly put a, a skimmer in the net in the last hour, hour and ten minutes. So those carp have really ruined my day. Um, I've weighed fifty nine pound, which is no good really. I think there was a, it was a sixty two, um, two two low seventies and an eighty two pound, which won, won my section. Scott Russell, so well done to him. Um, to be honest, you. I think I could have caught 80 pound if those carp had not turned up like they did I think 80 pound was was well capable but those carp just come in and they've just ruined the swim to be honest like the last hour every every drop I went in I I'm basically playing a carp and it's just it's just ruined my ruined my day to be honest but you know that's fishing you know it is what it is and on another day I might have caught all big bream on our short line and uh, you know be, be talking about winning the match so it didn't really go my way but I've had a really enjoyable day 59 pound of skimmers and what a venue laugh it is really you know it's full and full of skimmers and some of the carp I've had today have been well one of them was probably 20 pound plus so you know I've had a lot of carp as well as the skimmers but the carp don't count so I've had to put them all back and yeah it's, it's, it's a nice day but not the winning end that I wanted so if you are liking this uh, this video like and subscribe like I always say hit the notification button and it'll notify you when I upload my new videos cheers guys see you soon